guys, Rondo Lim here and welcome to my YouTube channel. For this video, we're doing a quarantine haul part 2. So let's go! Again, welcome to my channel. So, ayun na nga. Kamusta kayo guys? How is quarantine life treating everyone? I know naka-GCQ na tayo now and there's a lot more freedom now. Yes, there's a lot more things to do now. But it's not like, you know, we're back to normal. So, I just hope you guys are all doing well as we adjust to this quote-unquote the new normal. Um, first things first, I may look down. So, sorry na lang in advance. Only because the camera we're using right here doesn't really have a flip screen. So, I can see myself and I have to see myself. So, naka ano tayo guys? Naka live mode connected to this phone. So, if I look down, can't be helped. It's an impulse. Um, a couple of weeks back, I posted my first video. It's another quarantine haul similar to this one. I'm not sure if nakita nyo na yun or not. If you haven't yet, you may wanna check it out only because well, if I must say, we really have some good finds there, amazing purchases. And if you're into those shopping haul vlogs, I'm sure magugustuhan niyo yun, hopefully. But ever since posting that one, and this is just a quick life update, I've been mostly preoccupied with redecorating my room. So most of my purchases now have been about home decor stuff, um, which I may or may not vlog about, by the way. Not quite sure if I wanna deviate away from my usual fashion content. So yeah, let me know in the comment section down below. Should I vlog about those things? Should I not? Let's see. But the point is, in between those home decor purchases, I managed to nab some fashion items which are gonna be the focus of today's video. So yeah, let's unbox them. Now on to our first item, and just like in our first haul video, this too is a bag. It's a crossbody bag from Kenzo which I got through Essence. And ano siya guys, nakasale siya from one if I'm not mistaken, from $190 box to $130, so that's around $65 Philippine currency. And, ano ba? I know, kakakuha ko lang guys ng bag, but I'm in that phase of wanting to collect them. Like, I used, not exactly not like bags, but I used to not care for them. Not as much as I did for shoes. Like most guys, I would presume. But now, I think I'm, well, I'm liking them, so I'm just trying to build up ang dulas, ha? I'm just trying. I'm just trying to build up my collection of them. And look at it, guys. It's very nice. Ita ba? Yeah, yeah. And I've always wanted to get a uh, a big everyday bag in white. Because I think if makikita nyo in my in my older posts in Instagram, I'm always in black. But as I mentioned in my previous vlog. I just wanna change that. I think I wanna add more colors to what I wear. And especially yung mga neutral shades like cream, uh, beige, white. I think I wanna start wearing them. And this is a good accessory to have. It is very big. I don't think I have to try to fit in all my things here. Kasi kita nyo naman. It's very spacious. So I like it. The only thing that I would change probably is the strap. Like, this is a, this is a good strap but I'm just tired of black ones I think this would have been better kung naging white siya so I might change it but it's just me now let's try our second package now on to our second item and it's a top from ASOS and I know nakakasabi ko lang na I would want to start wearing less and less of black so it's gonna be ironic na I'm gonna pull out one but I don't really care it's nice let's let's call it an exception guys when it's nice and look at this one. It's very, it's very chic. I like the material. It's silk, so uh, to sa satin kasi diba it's hot. So what do you guys think? Because it's really not my style, but that's what's good with fashion, diba? It's ever changing. It's evolving. So I think so should your style. Um, so with this one, I'm still not sure. I'm still not sure how I style it. Maybe just I'm thinking like a plain white shirt underneath. Or like a sando, or I'm not sure if I'll go nothing underneath it. 
Uh, but yeah, maybe just wait for my Instagram post. I'm sure it's gonna be soon. So yeah, two thumbs up. And for our third item, it's gonna be the biggest one inside the paper bag. So yeah, let's open it. Wait. I need... Hold on, guys. For this one, guys, it's not really something I bought. It's a gift from... Uh, I can't even pronounce their name. Because I can't pronounce R, so I'm not even gonna attempt. So it's somewhere there in the video. Okay, you can check them out. They're available in Lazada. This one, I think, is you can buy for 1500 And it's a camera bag. Like a real camera bag. Nice. What do you guys think? So it's 14 inches and I think wait, hold on. So it's a camera bag, but I think pwede na yun siyang maging laptop bag. Yeah, it's very spacious inside. If you don't really carry that or you don't really carry a lot of lenses. I think I at least um, two cameras, two mirrorless cam uh, cameras. What do you guys think? But if it's not enough for you, I think man, pa silang 17 inches. This is the second to the biggest. You can get that one. Yeah, check them out. But it's really stylish. I think I have another camera bag na medyo maliit, so kaya lang isang yung laman. So this one is a really good one to have just in case I decided to purchase another camera for vlogging. What do you guys think? Ah. Love it. For the fourth and fifth items guys, may job na natin just because well gutom na ako. And they're both from Lazada anyway, so yeah. Starting with this shirt. Ah, and it's a tie-dye shirt kasi di ba medyo nagbabalik na ngayon yung mga tie-dyes I don't know if napapansin nyo and this is a really good color and uh, ang ganda ng, ng tela guys medyo makapal siya which is just what I wanted and the pagka tie-dye it's really nice, really good the size well I know sa Lazada kasi di ba medyo small yung sizes nila so I got the biggest one just because I'm into oversized shirts. So this is Triple XL. So if you're like me na medyo oversized magsuot, get, get the biggest one. So yeah, what do you guys think? Although binili ko siya, thinking na ipapambahe ko lang siya, but seeing it now, it could easily well be uh, worn outside. So yeah, for me to say that, it's really good. And for our last item, it's a bucket hat from Lazada again. And it's just the same with my last purchase. I don't know kung nakita nyo nga yung last vlog. It's the same dun sa cream bucket hat. But comparing to that, I think that's better. Just because with this one, yung color medyo dull. I didn't think na magiging faded siya. I thought it would be a lot more vivid. But other than that, yeah, it fits well. It's nice. What do you guys think? Yeah, it's cute. Yeah, it's cute anyway. Um, so yeah. What do you guys think of my purchases? What do you like most? What do you like least? Comment down below. Like, subscribe, and thank you guys for watching.